If you want to tangle with fickle, hard-to-hook trout, you need to be pulling soft plastic grubs. If you want to get into grub trolling, get on over to fishhuntshoot.com and grab one of Kel Kellogg's Signature Series grub kits today and you'll be yelling fish on tomorrow. Again. Good one. You're doing great, just keep reeling them in nice and slow. Yeah, it's cold water. They find pretty good. Yeah. He's pulling drag. Uh -huh. You look like an alright fish. Definitely stain down here though. Oh, he's bad. There he goes. All right. Oh, off the hook. Off the hook. Nice. Oh, oh. Good Quick thing release. you kept the line Good deal. <laughs> oh. Collins Lake. Yeah, nice fat fish. Awesome. Howdy, guys. Kel Kellogg here. I've been guiding trout anglers for about a year now and uh, I've made a lot of observations and you know I'm gonna assume that I'm fishing with a cross section of the of the trout fishing community out there some of the guys I fish with are, are pretty experienced some of them have never even caught a trout before but uh, you know every day I give everybody the same seminar and uh, for some folks it's enlightening and uh, some folks they don't seem to listen because I see them make fundamental mistakes that I just went over in the morning seminar, but I'm gonna pass this seminar on to you. Um, I catch a lot of trout of all sizes out on my boat, but I catch a lot of large trout. In fact, just a couple days ago, we had an 11 pound trout on the boat. And uh, if you aren't doing a lot of things right when you catch an 11 pound trout on trout tackle, you're gonna lose that fish. So here's my seminar that I do every single morning, okay? First and foremost, when you're hooked up with a fish, I don't want any heroics. I don't want you pumping the fish up and down, none of that. I don't want you pointing your rod at the fish. I want you to hold your rod up at about a 45 degree angle, and I want that reel in motion. Kind of backing off the drag here so I can reel. I want that reel in motion the entire time, okay? If the fish is running away from you, I want the reel in motion. If the fish is coming at you, I want the reel in motion. If the fish is jumping, guess what? Reel in motion. None of this, no pumping the fish, none of that. None of, oh boy, the fish is running away from me. I better lock down the drag. The drag is there in case you catch a big fish so he doesn't snap your line. So once again, I want the rod at 45 degrees. I want you grinding on the rod and I want you using the springiness of the rod to wear the fish down and to cushion the head shaking. That rod should always be loaded against the fish and that keeps the hook in the fish's mouth. If you just do that, you're gonna land almost all the trout you hook. Now, you're gonna lose some, but you're not gonna lose those really big iconic fish most of the time that you work so hard to hook. So to reveal, Keep the rod at 45 degrees. It's not sexy. Just keep working the reel and set your drag light. My drags are set very light. It's better to have a drag set too light than too tight. That even rhymes. Write that down. You don't want the drag too tight. It's better to have it too light. All you need to do is keep the line tight, load the rod tip against the fish, keep the reel in motion, and you're gonna wear those fish down, you're gonna land those fish, you're gonna be the guy with a big smile on his face holding up an 11 pound trout. If you're the guy that's pumping on the fish, you're gonna give him slack and they're gonna throw your lure. If your drag's too tight, you're gonna catch a big fish, he's gonna run, he's gonna snap your line, and uh, if you're not reeling all the time, the fish is gonna come at the boat real fast, slack's gonna develop, and it's gonna be bye-bye trophy fish. Anyway, that is my morning seminar that I give to everybody that fishes on my boat. 
take it to heart and I guarantee you it will help you catch more and bigger fish throughout the course of the season, throughout the course of your fishing career. It's not sexy, but it's super effective. That's my method for landing big fish and uh, I hope you're able to put that to use out on the water. I'm Kel Kellogg, I'm signing off for now. If you're looking for trout fishing gear, including my signature series rods, go on over to fishhuntshoot.com and check out our store. And if you haven't subscribed, please take a second to hit that subscribe button and you'll always know when I'm on here talking about fishing tactics. Thanks a lot, guys. Look at that stud of a rainbow, wow. What a beautiful fish. Incredible. He's heavy. He's super heavy. Wow. Very nice.